Right. Hello, here we go then. This is to prove that you can remotely control Sam. So there we've got Sam set up on the computer in the background, I hope you can see that. We've got my mixer, the microphone, and beside that we've got a little black box with a red and a blue button on it. Hopefully you'll see that when I push the red button, the mic is keyed. When I let go of the red button, the mic is de-keyed. Keyed, de-keyed. You can hear it because I'm making the button make noise. But normally during broadcast, you just gently push the button, you wouldn't hear a thing. Also, the blue button will start the track. So what you'd do is you'd key your mic, you'd introduce the track, then you'd push the blue button, and the track starts. You can key the mic during the track, which quietens it down. You won't hear my voice because I've got the mic set to go straight to output. But then when you let go of the key button, the music comes back up to play volume. We'll fast forward that track to the end, and we'll do an introduction for the next track. So as that track finishes, you key the mic, you say goodbye to that track, keeping the mic keyed, you'd push the blue button, which starts the second track on the second deck, introduce that one, let go of the microphone, and the volume comes back up to its play volume. Quite easy to control Sam, just with the two buttons and a mixer, no need to go over to it at all, so all my work is done on that PC.